Coping Through Pain How Some People Harness Masochistic Tendencies for Stress Relief Pain and pleasure are two complex sensations deeply ingrained in the human experience. While most of us naturally avoid pain, some individuals find solace and even stress relief in embracing it. This inclination toward experiencing pain for personal gratification is often referred to as masochism. It's a concept that has fascinated psychologists, researchers, and individuals alike for years. This video explores the curious phenomenon of masochism and how some people utilize it as a means to cope with stress. For some, self-inflicted pain can be a powerful coping mechanism. When experiencing pain, the brain releases endorphins, natural chemicals that act as painkillers and mood elevators. This endorphin rush can provide a sense of euphoria and relaxation, serving as a welcome escape from the mental anguish that stress often brings. Furthermore, inflicting pain on oneself can serve as a form of self-punishment or catharsis, allowing individuals to release pent-up emotions and regain a sense of control in their lives. Masochistic tendencies for stress relief can manifest in various forms, from rigorous physical activities like extreme sports, intense workouts, or even tattooing and body piercing to non-physical practices like emotional self-flagellation or self-imposed isolation. Individuals who engage in these behaviors often report that the temporary discomfort helps them gain perspective on their problems and provides a renewed appreciation for life's simple pleasures. Moreover, masochism can foster resilience. By voluntarily subjecting themselves to challenging or painful situations, individuals can build mental and physical toughness. It can help them confront stressors and adversities in their everyday lives with a greater sense of resilience and self-assurance. In this sense, masochism is a coping mechanism that enables people to face stress head-on, making them better equipped to deal with the demands of life. It's essential to differentiate between healthy masochistic tendencies for stress relief and harmful self-destructive behaviors. While some may find solace in measured forms of masochism, excessive or dangerous practices can lead to physical harm or emotional distress. Therefore, individuals should approach these coping mechanisms with caution and ideally under the guidance of professionals who can ensure their safety and well-being. It's worth noting that masochism is not a one-size-fits-all solution to stress relief. What works for one person may not work for another, and the line between beneficial masochistic tendencies and harmful behavior can be blurry. People should always strive for a balanced approach to coping with stress, combining healthy stress management techniques such as exercise, meditation, therapy, and social support with any masochistic tendencies. In conclusion, masochistic tendencies for stress relief are a fascinating aspect of human psychology. Some individuals have discovered that embracing pain, whether physical or emotional, can provide them with a sense of control, release, and even euphoria when confronting stress. However, these practices should be approached with caution and only used in conjunction with other, more traditional stress relief strategies to ensure a balanced and healthy approach to managing life's challenges. <laughs>